everyone, this is Jane of Crane the Heart, and I'm back with a haul. So I've got a haul from Scraptique. It's uh, scrapbooksnstickers.com, and um, they had a sale, scraptique.inc. It is um, Club G35 kits. They were $35 each, and I thought that was a pretty good deal um, because, in the most part, you got um, full... Um, a full kit including the paper and everything to make the projects so this one right here it comes in a in a cool bag zip bag this one is I believe this is October 2019 and in this kit you get um, get everything out and then I'll show you everything that you get in this kit so this makes a angelic altered book box, and I believe you usually there's more than one project. So I think it also makes some tags, a oh, Christmas card trio, and I use tags for that. So let me go ahead and show you what you get. Um, <clears throat> so you get the book box, Graphic 45, the book box. So put that aside get that the directions you get the joy to the world collection pack and in this you get two each of 12 by 12 papers of six I'm sorry of eight double-sided 12 by 12 papers and one of each of two six by 12 cover weight stickers so you get 16 sheets of paper and then you get two different sticker sheets in this collection pack <clears throat> And then you also get this right here, which is the cardstock die cuts. Get that. Let me make those little pockets, I think. You get 3D foam frames, and then you get these corners, the ornate metal corners. And you get those. And that kit was $35. Then the next kit that I have to show you, I got three of them, because if you spent $75, then um, your shipping was, was free. All right, so this is the November 2019 Club G45 kit. It makes a Dreamland accordion mini album. And it also makes this dreamy display stand. So you get your directions, all in full color directions. And so then I can use this to make other projects. You get the deep rectangle match book box. It's a pretty big box, actually. You get that. You get the Dreamland paper. And I haven't ever had this paper, so I'm excited to, to get to use this. And it's the 8x8, the whole paper collection. You get the chipboard with this, little punch outs. You get these feet. It's the antique brass claw feet. And then you get the Dreamland die cut assortment. So you get that. And then the last kit that I got, um, it's the December 2019 club kit. I believe you also get a, I'm going to get the ink pad. Okay. So in this kit, um, you get the directions, of course. And this kit makes a wrap folio. It makes a wrap folio. And then it makes a tag trio. So you get to make a tag trio with that. And let's see here. You get the Graphic 45, the Life's Journey. You get the Patterns and Solids, which is really kind of a smart way of using this um, because you also, because what they're going to do to decorate that is they're actually going to be using, it looks like I'll be using these cards to decorate the front of everything, which is, now that I've seen that, I think it's really smart. This is the 4x6 and 3x4 journaling and ephemera cards. 
and a premium double-sided tape, the metal clock keys, the um, it's like a sticker sheet, and 12 by 12 uh, black chipboard sheets, me medium weight chipboard sheets in black. So that's pretty cool. And then um, a tape runner, easy runner, and then the Graphic 45 Decades Antiquing Dye Ink, um, kind of like a brown. Okay, so those are what I got from Scrap Teak. And then I got my order from Joann's. So I had um, money to spend at Joann's um, for Mother's Day. So my mom gave me um, $100 to spend at Joann's. So that, that was really, really fun to shop and know that everything was paid for. So the mink. I really, really want to use my mink. I had been wanting to use it for a while, especially since they came out with new stuff. And she came out, Heidi Swap came out with a toner ink, which can't find anywhere right now. It's just sold out. And Tim Holtz did some amazing stuff on his live on Instagram. You also can find it on Heidi Swap's Instagram as well. And it's amazing, all the things that he did with Distress. Um, but just some really cool techniques on using um, the Mink Toner ink. So I'm going to hopefully be able to get that toner ink. But in the meantime, I got the stamp cleaner for that toner um, ink. Fingered. I might as well pick that up since I was um, shopping there. I got a bunch of the Tim Holtz Distress Tags. There's 20 of these. It's the number 8 size, the mixed media tags. Um, the Mink, I got some new colors. So I got this holographic. Um, I got this like leopard print, I got this rainbow, and then I got white. And I'm back to having a ton of stuff to put away, so that kind of sucks. Um, I got the Pebbles collection, um, the birthday wishes, or happy hooray, I'm sorry, um, the enamel dot confetti one. I got the ephemera. And I got the um, project pad which is really I think a really great deal if you can find the project pad in any of them they do Chamel I have one with Chamel I have one with Maggie Holmes um, and they have a lot of solids um, kind of a lightweight cardstock very lightweight and then it's got your patterns really fun patterns in this and then usually you get some glitter cardstock so this glitter cardstock there and then um, the cut aparts have glitter as well in this one. And then you get two sticker sheets. So, and I think it's $10 normal price. I think it was um, half, half price. And then I did get some other fun things. Now, I already have this marker. However, it's dried out. And I use it all the time. And you cannot buy any um, refills right now. Like, none. This is the E23. They're redoing their refills. So, they're like sold out of refills just about everywhere because Copic is redoing how they do their refills. And I guess maybe because of COVID, they can't come in. I don't know, but I just went ahead and bought the marker since I had kind of free money. So I really wanted to get and try these. And what I really, really liked about these was the fact that they have an applicator already built in, which I think is just super cool. I kind of wish all of the um, things that I have had that because I think it's really neat. So some fun stuff here that I can't wait to try. Um, let's see, luster polish, opal polish. So I got the opal polish and this creates a polished opal sheen and shimmering highlights to all your projects. So I got um, this one. It's so pretty. It's like this blue, lustry, like sky type blue. And then it's got, um, let's see if I can get this, I don't know how, it, how, how you get it off, but you have an applicator that goes right on the top, which I think is just genius, you know, I mean, genius and it pops right back in. So I got the blue I got, and this one's called Summer Sky. This one is in blue parakeet. Uh, motion, apply by finger, cloth roller, ribbon stamp. 
Um, so really cool. And then this one is Lilac Rose. So I don't know if these are the ones. There are ones where if you do it on white cardstock, it looks one way. And if you do it on black, it changes to a completely different color. So I don't know if I got that one or not. I'll have to look it up and see. But these are the ones that they had um, on Joann's that I really wanted to, to try. This one is a luster polish. And this color is Dazzling Denim. And this color is just gorgeous. So I, I can't wait to try that on a project and see, you know, what I come up with with that. But those, that's what I got from Joann's. It's a hundred dollars. Uh, these were expensive. So I, I kind of loved getting those um, and not having to pay for them. But that's my haul. Thank you for watching. This is Cindy Paint the Heart.